Good day. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Atari 8-Bit Gameplay. I've got here a Junior Pac-Man, which somehow I missed in my playing of all of the Pac-Man games. I have gone through and searched my channel content, and I'm going to try a slightly different tack on it. I do not see it anywhere. I've played the arcade version of Junior Pac-Man, and I have played the 2600 version of Junior Pac-Man, and I have yeah, I don't see it. I don't think I have. So that's interesting to me because I do think I have memories of playing this one when I was a teen. Let me uh, let me pull up the uh... yeah. Here we go. 1984 by Atari. No programmer. Oh, it's a prototype. Hmm, I wonder. Well, we'll see. We'll see if I have any memories of playing this. I feel like I do. Um, where did my screen go? There we go. There we go. Whoop, and I lost it because I keep clicking on the background. All right. Can I... Okay. This is very similar to all of the Atari arcade conversions. And you've got these different toys indicating the different levels. I think the teddy bear is the child. So we'll go with the bicycle, which seems to me to be the what I remember as being the starting toy prize thing. A little bit of graphical glitches popping in and out here. The ghosts are moving quite choppily. Do I remember this or don't I? Gosh. I mean, it's quite similar to... Obviously quite similar to um, the actual arcade game. Come here, you bicycle. 100 points! Woohoo! I wonder why the, why the ghosts move so uh, spasmodically like that. Alright, let's grab a power pill or two, power pellet or two, and see what we can come up with here. As far as a prototype goes, this level is looking pretty, pretty solid. So Junior Pac-Man, as I'm sure you can tell by now, is uh, an interesting extension of the whole Pac-Man, Pac-Person franchise. Pac-Entities, your maze uh, scrolls, and um, all of that kind of stuff. Do I want to grab this? Mm, oh, whoa, whoa, that wasn't great. Where's the other ghosty, roasty toasty ghosty? Where did it go, man? Aren't there supposed to be four? I'm sure, I'm a, der, there are supposed to be four, and I'm sure there were before. That's funny. Oh, oh, two were just direct, like exactly, identically on top of each other. That's weird. Ooh, that was almost fatal mistake on my part. Go! I, I think I got the... I think I heard the extra life beepy noise at 10,000. Did I clear out the side of the maze? I... Uh, yes, I did. I think I could remember that for 13 seconds or so. But... but no. Come here, you. I want the points. Thank you. Thanks for your cooperation with being consumed by a junior pack. I do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. And that's level one. 
Done. Done and dusted. Um, oh, here we go. A little faster. A little... Oh, we're on a different maze, though. Is that how the original went? I feel like you might have had to do the first maze more than once. How much time does I get? Not that much. Looks like 800's gonna be it. A kite. Hello, mister. Oh, that felt like I was ripped off. You get more points for those big, chonky um, pellets that have been run over by the toys. They also, I think, destroy the power pellets, so you don't want that. If I remember right, I believe that's what they do. Oh, no, 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 I tried to turn. I tried to turn to go back towards the pellet there. Oh, well. <laughs> Ooh. So turning is the traditional way to escape from the ghosts. Otherwise they can gain on you quite easily. Oh, that was not, not ideal, to say the least. How many junior packs have I got? Three remaining, I think? Looks like three. Okay, you ghosts, you can come over here now that I'm sitting waiting on a pellet. Oh, that was not ideal. Interestingly, you can sort of change your decision that you already made to go down one pathway or the other. That was a bit close. Sometimes you have to just be willing to go with the flow that way, though. Oops, not that way, though. Where is that kite? Or, yeah, kite. Clear out that portion and get across to the other side. Oh, no, don't, don't! Ooh, that was close. I think, I'm pretty sure they do eat the, the power pellets, the toys. Maze number three. I don't, I really don't think that's the way it went in the arcade, but maybe it did. I thought you had to do each maze more than once. Ooh, that's, uh, I don't know what that kind of toy that is. What the hell? What happened there? <sighs> well, I guess that's, uh, that's why it's a prototype, I suppose. Let's, uh, I was on that level, so let's go back to that. The level just terminated abruptly for no... As you saw. You saw it. I know you did. Oops. When the pill is at an intersection like those ones are, it's maybe a little, uh, a little challenging to grab sometimes. Oh no! I didn't actually want to use my power pellet thing. Oh, that was fast. My power pellet thingamadoo is what I was going to say. Okay, time to go over to the other side here. Lots of zigzaggy stuff. Whoa, in this uh, maze. I say, ooh. Ah, damn, 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 damn. That was close. That was close. Too close. Re 
ridiculously close. Hey, I got 800. Okay, well, I haven't, uh... I haven't perished, so that's good. We'll just go to for the compl completion of the maze. Completion of the moose. Of course, I don't have the points that I had first go around. Oh, the ghosts are no longer moving chonkily. Interesting. So the chonkiness seems to be uh, a way of slowing them down. Well, why not just have them move more slowly? I mean, why have them go boink, 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 boink like that? That seems stupid. Oh, ooh, that was arguably lucky, and that was arguably unlucky. Oops. Of course, I'm looking at my phone. My wife's texting me. Alrighty. It is choir time today. And she's concerned that she doesn't have her choir binder, which is true. She doesn't, but I remembered to throw it into the old vehicle, so I have it. Whoops. Whoa. Ah. Go, 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 go. Turn, turn. Bum. Bum. Bum is what I say, and bum is what I mean. Another kite? Two kites? That's weird. Whew, that felt a little... a little touch and go... Oh! Oh, I was banking on him to go the other way. Oh, I've got three power pellets. Oh, interesting. Um, hmm. Oop, nope, not that one. Trying to figure out how I can uh, get some of these dots without compromising my... Oh, no, that's not actually what I wanted to do, but anyway, should work out okay. There we go. End of, end of level. No intermissions in this, which, uh, maybe not surprising. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Just about out of... Out of, uh, packs. Out of junior packs. And I've got spots left laying all over the damn place. Oops, that wasn't good. That was piss poor is what that was. Alright, I'm going to pause this, respond to my wife's text, and then I'll come back and play a little, a little bit more. Okay, so... Oh, no, 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 that's not what I want. I want to play on the train level. There's the train, oh, and then cat. Okay, I want to play on the train level. Second type of kite, and then train. Doo-doo-doo. I do like the fact that it's got all the different mazes. That's, um, it's quite cool, as well as the scrolling nature of the maze. Hey, the pack... Pack dudes are all jumpy again. That's weird. That's not. It's not what it was just now when I was playing. It wasn't like that. So why is that? He asked somewhat rhetorically. That, yeah, I guess that's the sort of thing that might be prototypey behavior, I guess. I really do feel like I... Ah, you bastard. I really do feel like I've played this before, though. I mean, it's possible that it's just my... my own uh, remembrances of playing the arcade game. But, uh... It's not exactly like the... Oh, come on now. Seriously. Ah! It's not... It's obviously not exactly like the arcade, but it is a, it is a really good conversion. Um, I'm not sure about the, oops, the rapid progression through the levels. That doesn't feel, doesn't feel quite right to me, but anyway. Ha, 
uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. That felt legit, he said, meaning that it did not feel legit. Oh, I cleared off this side, okay. All right, I'm just gonna go for the screen clear here. And maybe a train grab, nope. Oh, I got it, thank, thank goodness. Oh no, that was too close for comfort. There we go. Da dum. Now we're on the cat level. Yay for cats. Now, this is an interesting looking maze. Oh, it really is. Oop. Foolishness. I turned. I should have just gone straight up. Obviously. Yeah, you've got these longer pathways on this level, which is interesting. Uh, the power pellets... The ghosts aren't all chonky, again. Like they've gone back to being non-chonky moving ghosts. And now I'm going to run away this way and try to get the cat. 2,000! Ooh, that was a good... That's a good bonus. Oh, plus an extra player. Just in the literal nick of time. So now the thing to focus on is really just finishing the, the mazes. As opposed to... Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh! Ah, damn. I don't know if there was any escape for me there. Game over! Okay, I'm gonna try cat level one more time, and then that's probably gonna do it. Deedly, deedly, dee, doo. Oh, bum. If I'd gone down, I'd, I would have been okay. little buggers run away from you uh, is kind of handy. Which is all you really get can expect out of a power pellet now. Ah, shoot. The big, the big chonky uh, dots slowed me down there. Oh, no! Ah, bastard. Okay, that was a mistake, obviously, to go directly for the dots. Do I have any more? Oh, I do. I have two more. Two more uh, power pills and more dots left than you can actually shake a stick at here. I'm gonna try and get... Oh no! Ooh, that was close. That was close. Oh no! Can I do it? No, I cannot. Okay, there we go. Now I just need to uh, somehow get around these bastards. And, uh, uh-oh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Oh, I do have one more player. Look at me. Oh, no! Bastard. I was close. All right, well, I guess I'm not going to find out what's after the cat level today. Sorry. I do need to wrap it up here, unfortunately. Good, good seems like it's essentially finished. I mean, there's a couple of things, obviously, that I observed, but nothing major. It's essentially a complete game, and it's a good one, too. So, with that, uh, I'm going to wrap it up for my look at Junior Pac-Man for the Atari 8-Bits. Thanks for watching. Do take good care of yourselves. I mean that. Seriously. Don't make me come over there and give you a stern talking to. You won't like it. You will not like it. So just avoid that and look after yourself, okay? Right, thanks. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.